I mean, at the top for us tonight, a look at the low water levels being seen at Lake Corpus Christi. Now, three news spoke with those who live next to the lake and who watch over the state park about their concerns with water levels. We begin tonight with Brandon Schaff, who's here with a look at what he was able to find out. Brandon. Hey, good evening, Leslie and Mike. Lake Corpus Christi is currently at about 45% capacity. It comes as the city of Corpus Christi announced that it will delay moving to stage two water restrictions with rain expected soon. But residents who live right next to the lake know better than anyone just how significantly low those water levels are right now. If you look at it from a, a vertical perspective, uh, the water's down about 11 feet from where it would normally be uh, here in front of our home and the other homes that are adjoining us. Corpus Christi at-large City Council member Mike Pusley has a home next to Lake Corpus Christi in Mathis. He's lived there for about 20 years and said the low water levels are noticeable, but he's seen it lower. And anytime this happens, it brings this to the top of his mind. The biggest concern for us uh, as residents here and residents of Corpus Christi is the access to a water supply, drinking water supply. Pusley said his property at the lake is not affected, but Corpus Christi's water supply is. With Corpus Christi supplying water for half a million people across seven counties, he said the low water levels at Lake Corpus Christi affect everyone that relies on it. Park Superintendent Kelly Ann Malkowski described how low water levels are affecting the conditions there as far as turnout. We've seen fairly minimal impacts to both our park visitation, people coming out and enjoying the park, um, and fairly minimal impacts to our wildlife. Malkowski said Lake Corpus Christi is busy year round with hundreds of people coming daily in January, regardless of the water levels. She said the lake could benefit from forecasted rain. Some rain in the basin in the watershed uh, could absolutely impact our lake levels. Um, but something that we learn again and again is the water has to fall in the right place. And Pusley says that Corpus Christi City Council is working to obtain additional water resources. Those include desal and groundwater plants. And he says that a key for staying out of stage two water restrictions right now is water conservation.